Good morning, everybody. I hope everyone's doing really well. My eyes feel very sensitive to the light and it's not even that sunny, which I think that just means I need to change up my contacts. Um, that's usually what that means. But we are running some errands today. Oh my gosh, I gotta close my eyes. We are running errands today because we've got the rental car. The goal is to pick up a few pieces of furniture um, and build them over the weekend or something like that. We need uh, definitely something in the little entryway for shoes and coats and all of that jazz. We need something there. We also need... <sighs> Roman and I really want to replace the sideboard in our living room because it's not, not the best for what it's intended to do. We went to Ikea yesterday with all these big plans of purchasing stuff last night and Roman and I were like, just, we were so unprepared last night. We just took measurements for everything. We're like, oh, I don't know if this would really work in the living room. Things are always different in person than on the internet. So we looked at things that we didn't necessarily notice online but we noticed it in person. I don't know, it's just kind of a mess. So we really just left Ikea yesterday with a bunch of cookies. Total waste of a trip. But it wasn't, because we were able to look at stuff and um, able to see stuff in person, so that's good. We're up early this morning. I'm really shocked that we're out of the house as early as we are. I wanna show you guys, Roman's having issues in this car. <laughs> And I'm not even making this up. That's no. His head is touching the ceiling. I don't even have space to steer. Yeah. Yeah, what is this? Uh, Vauxhall Insignia. Vauxhall Insignia. AKA Opal Insignia. I don't know what the GM equivalent to that is. Isn't it Peugeot? No. Peugeot bought Opal. Uh -huh. Vauxhall two weeks ago. Oh, two weeks ago? Yeah, but until then, it was GM. <laughs> okay, that's called Important Facts with Roman. <laughs> Callum, what did you find? I found the elevator. You found the elevator? What's that in your hands? A red car! A red car pillow! Yeah, we got the G. Mind the doors, please. Okay, that's enough. Callum, would you like that for your big boy room? Yeah. Yeah. We're purchasing lots of little pillows that he loves so that he'll love sleeping in his big boy bed by himself, huh? We're here in HomeSense looking at some uh, potential furniture options. Hey, everybody. We actually had some success. Roman is loading it in the car with the, the guy who works here and with Callum. And I've got Sleepy right here. Oh, she's snoozing. So that worked out really well. But yeah, we ended up finding something that we're gonna put in the very front of the apartment where we can collect all of our shoes and stuff. It's a little bit damaged, but it's just cosmetic, just a little teeny cosmetic nick. And when you look at the actual piece, it looks like um, it kind of goes with the, the style of the, of the actual sideboard. So it was, I think originally like 600 something pounds. And because of the nicks, no one was buying it. And they ended up selling it to us for 73 pounds. So I'm really excited because we could not have gotten anything of that size, even if we wanted to. So it all worked out really well. Make sure I have everything because Roman's already paid. Um, ooh, it is warm today. How does that happen? It was so cold yesterday and now it's so warm. I don't know. Anyways, so I wonder if they'll be able to load it into the car. We could get it delivered, but I'm just really happy that we got this really cool piece of furniture. It's really cool. So we'll come back tomorrow. But if you come back tomorrow, then you guys stay at home because otherwise it won't fit Let's again. just come back tomorrow. Yeah, that's fine. Will it fit when it's you- It's gonna be cool. Just no, I don't think so. That's no, just I'm too big. If it oh, you had to make it. Wah, wah, wah. They're taking it away. No, Roman's gonna come back tomorrow and get it. I mean, honestly, you've got a lot of stuff you have to bring to the recycle center tomorrow anyway, so you can just come out and get it. 
Hi. You like the way that feels? That does feel really nice, Linnea. Oh, that's so soft, isn't it? Yeah. That's so soft. Callum's tired. Yeah. Look at that one. Ooh, feel that one. That feels different than that one. <laughs> so sweet. Sweet girl. Next stop, Ikea. We've got a little rug for the play area, but look at this. Look at this little kid. He is completely out. Never in my life have I ever seen this. He's never done this. We just let him watch a little bit of iPad and he is out. It's so peaceful, huh? Yeah. All of a sudden, it's just so peaceful. It's amazing. Linnea's snoozing too. I think we're done home shopping for the day. Ooh. It's been a long day. I haven't vlogged everything. Um, just because I don't vlog if I have my hands full with kids because I have to, I just feel like that has to be first. So, and it's mostly so I can keep them safe and keep everyone else around them safe. But now that they're sleeping, it's so much more enjoyable. I think we're done. I think we are done for the day. We do have to go to Sainsbury's and get something for dinner and get groceries. So it's the last trick, no for schnellen autos. We got this for Callum today from Ikea. We figured instead of getting well, the um, <laughs> instead of getting a different play mat, we would just get a little street street no, what is this called? A little street rug. Sweet rug. A little street rug. Do you like it? Yes, sweet rug is on the way to Mm-hmm. It's going around the street. Aww. That's a new sweet. Yep, so this uh, this actually works out well. It kind of kills two birds with one stone. We needed a rug for them to play on. And Calm's got a an endless supply of streets. <laughs> That's a fun street. It's a fun street? That's a fun little street. Good. It's fast. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog so that I can clean up. Roma and I were just saying now that Linnea is crawling and she's taking everything out of all of the toy baskets, it's just, it's really hard to keep this place clean. I think this is just the way it's going to be, but wouldn't have it any other way. So thank you all for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.